Otherwise, we are simply thinking about stocks all the day. Samudra Pita Kausheya Vasasi Samupathara Varunasrayam Vaijayantim Madhunam Atashatpadam And this is, this is why I suggested these people today that when you are going to bring Mahalakshmi for the first time when people are going to have Darshan now she has emerged from the ocean and therefore the Milky Ocean is called as the father of Mahalakshmi and he brings his daughter draped in yellow clothes, yellow sari, golden yellow sari. This is how people first have her Darshan in the yellow yellow sari. Varuna Sajam Varuna brought her the garland of flowers. Varuna is the god of waters. He brings that garland, which means the garland which does not wither away, which does not, what do they say, the flowers? Wilt, huh? yes. Of flowers which do not wilt. And then, Bhushanani Vichitrani Vishwakarma Prajapati Haram Saraswati Padmajo Nagash Jakundadev Bhushanani Various ornaments were brought by Vishwakarma. He is the craftsman, he is the artisan of the Devata. He has crafted the ornaments that Lakshmi should be wearing. Haram and uh, uh, another garland was brought by Saraswati. The Nagas, the serpents, gave her the Kundalas, the earrings, ornaments of ears. And now, Lakshmi has to choose whom she, whom she should take as her husband. Everybody is saying, hello, I am here, I am the right candidate. <laughs> Everybody is competing that I should have Lakshmi. But you ask Mahalakshmi, whom does she want to choose? And she has put some conditions because she is looking at everyone. Everyone's eyes are held, what do they say? Glued to her form, thinking that she is going to choose me. She has to. Success will choose you. Prosperity will choose you. Lakshmi, that wealth will also choose you. But mind you, which is a place that she chooses to live is also something that you have to see. Look at this. Tatakruta svastya yanot palasrajam naratvirefam parigrahiya panina Chachala Vatram Sukapola Kundalam Sabrida Hasam Dadati Sushovanam Tatastato Mukura Valga Shinjikai Visarpati Hemalapeva Sabalau Vilokayanti Niravatya Matmanaha Param Druvam Chapya Vichari Sukhsargunam Lakshmi her beauty is being described. Holding that fragrant flower, I mean garland of flowers in her hand, because the one whom she puts that garland on is her husband. She has chosen that person, Swayamvara. But whom, whom is she going to? There has to be a condition. How are you going to decide which person is that that you want? And here he says, as she walked through the rows of people claiming that here we are, he is, he is, he is. As she walked, it appeared as if it was a lightning in the sky passing through all these people. Below uh, Kayanti and with a smile on her face and pinched Vridam, kind of little shy, a shy smile on her lips, 
she walked through people. Gandharva yaksha sura siddha charani hi Lai vishtapeya shunavadam virankaha Noonam kapoyasya as she passed through range of people. Here is what she says. Noonam kapoyasya namanyur nirjayo I can see some people who have done a great sacrifice in life. Tapaha. They have done penance. They have undergone a lot of what do they call it? They have forbear they have a forbearance to undergo difficulties of life. But what they lack is that they do not have any control over anger. They are not victorious over that. Not krodaha. Manyu nirjayaha. They, they do not have jaya over manyu. Jnanam kvachitta chana sangavarchitam. I see some people who are very knowledgeable. And though they are knowledgeable, yet these people are not free from attachments. And that's why she goes on disqualifying people, looking at all these things. They, the person may be knowledgeable, but if he does not have a, that, what do they say, non-attachment, if he is not desireless, and Lakshmi says, okay, rejected lot. Now, Kashchen Mahasasyana Kama Nirjayaha I can see some people who are indeed great and they have achieved great heights. They may be standing as the presidents of country or presidents of nations, but they are not Kama Jitaha. They have not won over their basic instinct. They can be easily lured. You know? I don't have to talk. We are in America. Uh, Kashchen maha sasyana kama nirjayaha saishwaraha kimparato vyapashrayaha Now what to talk about somebody who, who claims that he is Ishwara? He is great, but his greatness is dependent on something else, somebody else. If your greatness is dependent on someone else, you are basking in somebody else's glory or something else's glory, then you are not great by yourself. It is just a reflected glory. If somebody feels that because I am wearing this branded clothes, there is something about me, basking in reflected glory. Lakshmi says, not fit candidate, go. <laughs> and she walks further, then, there are some people who are given to a righteous living. Dharma is there. But such people at times lack compassion. There are self-righteous people. They say, this is right and this is how it has to be done. It just has to be done because this is right. Now such a person at times with that attitude of wanting to do right things and being self-righteous, he forgets that there is a kindness. The kindness is also a value that you have to have in life. So she says, gone, you are also gone, sir. Move, let me go ahead. Uh, she keeps on rejecting. Then there are some people who live a life of dispassion. You know, austerity. They are going to live that life of austerity. Though they may have austerity, but that tyag, that austerity may not even lead you to liberation. Not necessarily. You are going to find such people. And therefore, she says, not even this, not even this. Viryam napumso stya jave ganishkritam 
there are some people who have got great courage and valor. But what use is that courage and valor when they themselves are defeated by death at the end? <laughs> you are defeated by death. That person who seems to be so courageous also has his own insecurities. And therefore defeated. So she says, no, not even such a person is one whom I am going to marry. She's talking about her marriage, okay? Look at girls, those who are still to marry. You know, when you are going to see, look at this place. Uh, I love you. Watch it. Chirayuna Sheila Mangalam. Some people are there who have a long life, longevity. They may have. But their Sheila Mangalam, their character is not auspicious character. <laughs> Shady characters. A long life, but wow. At 80 also he wants to chase some girls at 80. No, come on. Make some space. You turn to others. This fellow says, no, I will keep Chalam Prash and run after. Nashila Mangalam Vachitta Dapyas Tina Vete Mahayushaha Some people have got great character, but they have short span of life. What will I do? He says, not even these. Then, Yatro Bhayam Kutra Chasopya Mangalaha Sumangala Kashchana Kaancha Tehimam But yes, there is one who is Sumangala, most auspicious. There is one who is most auspicious, who fits all my requirements. But this who is Sumangala, does not desire me. <laughs> Look at this. You know, this is the problem that all of us have. In Hindi they say, Nagaya Hindi we say, Daat hote hai to, chane nahi. Aar chane hote hai to, daat nahi. I'll tell you what it means. When you have teeth, you don't have peanuts. And when you get the peanuts, you don't have the teeth. This is irony of life. Lakshmi also has the same problem. She wants a guru who has got all these gunas. And the, the, the man who has all these sadgunas, all these qualities, is not a who desires her. Then what does Lakshmi do? She says, you may not desire, but I am holding the garland in my hand. <laughs> I have the choice. So she says here, Yatro bhayam kutra chaso kamangalaha sumangala kashchana kaam shate himam evam vimrashya vya vichari sadgunai varam vijay ka shrayata gunashrayam vavre varam sarvagunai rapekshitam ramamukundam nirapekshamitsitam then Rama, Mahalakshmi, goes to see this Vishnu is not at all worried, Narayana is not worried. Even in case of Parvati, you know, all of these gods, they come to Himalayas, they say that your daughter is so beautiful, get her married to me. And Parvati says, I am going to do tapasya. Huh? And whom do you want to marry? She said, I want to marry Shiva. Shiva wants you? He says, no, but I want it. That's what I want. women, please remember, I'm a Pakka feminist. Uh, I'm telling you, it's very open. <laughs> Look at the commonalities between the Charitra of Narayana and Charitra of Shiva. And when you are able to see these undercurrents, you will understand the Shastra whether it wants to talk to you about that reality as Shiva or as Narayana, it is the same thing. These are the qualities which are required. If you want 
a lasting prosperity in your life. These are the qualities which you should develop. These are the values which one must have. Then you become a place where Lakshmi can come and stay. When one does not have it, the shloka says, look at this. It is said that those people who are lazy, Duragrahi, Duragrahi means insistent, who are not ready to change for good, Lakshmi does not even cast a glance on them. And that's why they remain very It is not that you get little wealth, little prosperity. Make your